so when you're playing solo and you're playing uh, forte or you're playing piano, okay, there is such a thing as too soft. And what I mean by that is, let's look at measure 11, okay, on this long, long ago as an example. Now, measure 11 is marked piano. Um, if I really lighten up and I try to play a piano, it, it's not going to sound that good. So, and young players always sometimes, sometimes get too soft. Okay, so a solo piano, right? It's really more like a, like a, uh, a solo piano. It's more like an orchestra. It's more like really like an orchestra mezzo forte. Okay, an orchestra mezzo forte, that's a solo piano. So you wanna put a little bit of weight on the bow to get some sound, some density in your sound. So that's still soft, but it's not, think of a beginner thinking piano, they think it's whispering, it's not whispering. It's just soft, but it's still, there's density in the sound. So don't play piano like this. That's not piano, that's just bad playing. Put a little bit of weight, make sure there's a tone, the, the tone has quality, make sure you have good tone quality, and there's density in the sound. Okay, and then forte, obviously, a little bit more weight on the bow, again, relaxed, uh, no tension in that bow, but more weight, pronation from your index finger, so feel the, the weight uh, here on the index finger. Night lap. And so there you get nice beautiful tone both with a forte sound and with a piano sound. And so if you're playing solo or with an accompanist on the piano, then it's beautiful and the piano never overpowers you. So I hope that helps you and thank you for watching.